Well, they beat Michigan State. <laughs> this is going to be a hard-fought ball game. I think Michigan's going to win by, by three points or yeah, less, three-point game. Yeah, you got to watch out for these rivalry games. I think Michigan's, I think Michigan's going to win the game, but I think it, this one's going to come down to the wire. Michigan has won. Michigan State won four of the last five, but no, Michigan offense wins this one. What's Michigan. going on with Rashawn Gary? You're starting to wonder, like, how serious is that ankle? And what's, what, is, it, is it serious? That's shoulder. 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 Is it, is it, yeah. is it serious or is it just, is he resting? Land, yeah. And, yeah, who knows? But to me, this is a Michigan team that defensively, obviously, is going to hang around. Michigan State's going to slop around to the fourth quarter, try to find a way to win it late. But I think Shea Patterson finds a big one-on-one -on -one matchup downfield and wins the game. All right, give me a quick one, Virginia and Duke. Um, Virginia had a big win against Miami last week, they did. But, but Duke will win today. Yeah, sorry, Chris Slade. If you're out there, I'm yeah. going Duke. <laughs> not so fast and not so fast. And Duke, no, no, Virginia makes yeah. it. For Chris Slade, Upset. I'm picking Virginia because <laughs> Drew let you down. So I'll go, I'll, I'll go with Virginia to knock off Duke. All right, North Carolina State and Clemson both undefeated, 3.30 Eastern on ABC. Who wins it? Wow, you know, this is going to be a tough one. I think that Clemson will prevail at home. I think Trevor Lawrence is going to take that step uh, that we've been looking for him to take. So I got Clemson in a close one, though. Yeah, I think Clemson's going to win the ball game. I'm excited to watch, though. I think it's going to be a, a really good ball game. Yeah, looking forward to it. Clemson, but 17 points is too much. Much closer. But, you know, Bear made a point earlier in the show that you know, it's, it's going to be much larger. He thinks Clemson's going to oh, blow them out. No. NC State has had Clemson's number the last two years, came so close two years ago to beating them in Death Valley. I think it'll be close, but I think, again, Clemson's defensive pressure getting after Finley's the difference. And games on ESPN. I might have said ABC, but you can always see it streaming live on the app. Or you give me a quick one here also in the Pac-12, SC and Utah. Tough place to play. Uh, I'm going to go with um, Utah. Utah's defense has been playing very well. I'm going to go Utah. Yeah, Cougs have played both teams. I've seen them both, but uh, I think uh, Utah's going to win the game. Utah, Utah's number one in defense. Utah, Utah. Man, I, I almost want to change my graphic here to no, USC. No, I'm going to no. go to USC. No, I'm really going to go to USC oh, just for the fans. Yeah. <laughs> JT Daniels, yeah, I think yeah. SC that gets it done. Yes. Yeah. If you really, there, there we go, there get the Trojan. If right. you really want to get booed, pick this one a certain way. <laughs> Washington. Washington comes into this game, a lot of injuries, guys beat up. They're going to go, but they're going to be uh, beat up. So I'm going with Colorado. Got the bucks. are going to win this game. And I actually, I actually do think the Bucs can win this game at Washington. It's going to be a good one. Washington. Washington. Washington is one of my favorite teams. Wow. Washington. 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 I'm going with you. I'm going Washington. Colorado's banged up at wide receiver. Chenault. Gimpy. Oh. Give me Washington oh. again for the great fans. Oh. You and I together. <laughs> and now the game everybody here is waiting on. They declare the state of emergency in Pullman to use city vehicles to get them here. There's been a run at local thrift stores, and they're just waiting to light them up if they can roast the Ducks tonight. It's something special, you know, those, those night games at Martin Stadium. Pullman's a crazy place to play, and we really look forward to putting on a good show. Our goal in the beginning of the year was to win the Pac-12. This game obviously has huge implications for that. It means everything, really, chasing the Pac-12 championship. we got to be relentless. Either they're going to rush the field on us, or we can rush the field on them. The stars come out when the lights come on. We beat them the last three times, and uh, we want to beat them this time. I've never been able to beat Washington State in my years being here. So it's definitely going to be a mama mentality. Couple of once beaten teams in the Pac-12 North. Is it going to be Wazoo or the, or the Ducks? I tell you what, Justin Herbert, I think, is the best quarterback west of the Mississippi. He's going to be the number one draft pick. I love Oregon's offense, but Corso showed a tape of Washington State's defense. Yeah. They're going to make a play, a play, a play late in the game, and I got the Cougars. Yeah. Herbie. Fifteen years to come out here and enjoy this crowd and enjoy this scene. It, this, this has been, I've been on the show 23 years, it's been one of the best scenes I've ever seen on the show. With that being said, <laughs> Oregon. I learned from him. <laughs> Drew, who have you got? <laughs> I hope the security's good. I hope the security's good. <laughs> 
And look, first, thank you guys so much for making the trip. Yeah, yeah. I actually brought you guys a little gift. I couldn't bring it up here. They wouldn't let me. I even brought one for you, Des, even though you ruined my Super Bowl. Hey, I wasn't going to bring that up. Yeah, I haven't no, seen you since 97, but you're looking good. Hey, but look, I, this, this is, is going to be an exciting game. We've got two great offenses. The big surprise, I think, on both sides is how well both teams are playing on defense. Yeah. But I think you're going to see a shootout. It's going to be a high-scoring ball game, and, of course, the Cougs are going to win at the end. Oh. There you go. Okay. It's a big moment. moment. We've all yeah, been this waiting is for. A big moment. Yeah. Okay. I've been doing game day for 32 years. I put on 56 different mascot heads, and I've come from Orlando, Florida, 2,852 miles to get here. And let me tell you something. It would take something special for me to pick against my beloved Ducks. But ladies and gentlemen, this is a special place and a special time. Give me that duck <laughs>